You may receive a sedative by mouth and an intravenous line may be put in. You will then be transferred to the operating table. The surgeon will apply an antiseptic solution to the skin on the interior of the ear canal and will then swab the area around the eardrum with a local anesthetic. While the anesthetic is taking effect, the surgeon will position a microscope in front of the ear. When the operative field is numb, the surgeon will use the microscope to help make a very small incision in the lower part of the eardrum so that the fluid can drain harmlessly away. In most cases, one or more drainage tubes are left in place to continue to allow fluid to escape during healing. Sutures are not required, as the eardrum will heal naturally. And the drainage tube will either fall out by itself, or it will be removed by the surgeon one to three weeks later.